Oh! 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 Where's he going? What is going on everybody? Welcome back today guys to the channel Forza Horizon 4. Today we're going to continue on with Fortune Island and I've actually made some good progress on the map. I've done a few events out here. I've actually made my way all the way up to the point where I cannot go any further until I start the brand new story mode which is actually uh, Drift Club 2.0. So this is pretty cool. I didn't know this was actually in the game. I progressed as far as I could off camera and then coming back today. So I did a couple of races and I think after this stage 5 show should unlock. Now I wanted to do a few things for today in particular. Now before we actually begin for today's episode, I wanted to open up an early Christmas gift that I got for myself right here. It's a box. It's pretty big, right? It's a pretty decent sized box. Let me know your guess. I'm actually running out of room here. So I'm going to go ahead and pop this wheel right off and that just comes right off just like that giving me uh, quite a bit of space to just kind of open this up here. So now I'd love to know down below, what did you get yourself for Christmas, man? I mean, sometimes you just need to get yourself something sometimes, right? I mean, that's it. Oh my God, I think you guys already know. I'll give you another letter, five, right? Of course, man, the 350 boosts out here. Huge shout out to Anthony. You guys follow him on Instagram. Uh, he actually got these for me, grabbed them on the day of launch. And uh, these are 11 and a half for me, so hopefully I don't need a size bigger. Apparently you're supposed to go about a half size up. Here we go, man. It's been a long time. Oh, they're a slider box. Damn! This is my first real expensive pair of shoes, I think. This is this is definitely my first set. Why is this stuck? What is it? Tell me it stops right there. Are you kidding me? Is that the way the boxes are made? <laughs> Damn it. You can tell it's my first set. I didn't even know that they just locked like that. Is that actually a thing? Hey, that's, that's a thing, man. I thought maybe they were just stuck, but... Here we go, man. Jeez, they are nice. These are the uh, 350 Boost Zebra V2. This is their second launch on these, and they look good, man. They look very clean. I'm going to wear them for today, man. We got to throw these on, but here we go, man. Looking good. This is my first set of Yeezys. I figured I'd grab these. These were an easy cop on the drop. They had quite a few of these. As long as you were there, right? I mean, I don't know if you ended up grabbing these. If you did, let me know. Easy Boost 350 V2. Original size, um... Size 11 and a half US, okay. Oh shit, they're tight. Oh, they're not super tight, but damn, I think they're gonna be too tight. These may be too tight. I mean, they may stretch out, but that's my big toe right there. And if I just kinda, I mean, maybe I'll wear into them. I mean, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts down below. They're definitely, they're tight. I'm going to kind of mess around with that a little bit after, but we have a new drift story mode to attend to 2.0. So we're using 2003 Honda Civic S2K, man. This is brand new. We have a wide body kit on here. I pretty much gave it a bunch of street upgrades to the car. Okay, so the drift story mode, brand new one right up here. We're not going to fast travel. Map's not that big. It won't take us that long to get up there. And we're also going to get to drive the car a little bit and test this thing out. I didn't do any tuning whatsoever, so this is uh, still stock. Just under 400 horsepower. Oh, it's nice. I was glad to see this coming to the game. I was also glad to see the wide body kit coming to the game for a uh, free car this week, right? I mean, that's always cool. Sounds good. Not my favorite car for drifting because of that kind of odd wheelbase that it has. Uh, but definitely a really nasty track car. As you guys can see, it just launched. It wants to go, man. We're going to let it go for a little bit here. We got Floppy. What up, Floppy? He's in our game here. Don't you dare hit me, sir. Thank you. I don't know why that van's coming out on the street when I'm out here. Oh, yeah. This is this is nice. It's not nice. as My shoe's not really fitting properly. Man. I can't believe that still, man. Just a little bit tight on the toe. Oh, okay. I thought he was going to hit me. Here we go. 1.4 miles. I knew it too, man. They even said on the easy site to order a half size up. I'm like, no, no, I usually, I'm usually about 11 and a half to 12, so you know, I want to keep it a small shoe. I got an achievement? What do I get? Top 50%. I didn't even do it, man. Reach round five of the island. Oh, okay, okay, that's why. All right, but I said to myself, I just wanted a smaller shoe because I knew they were a little bit bigger. And I may have, uh, oh, hey, okay, Peter. cool. Hello. Those unconfirmed reports of another Fortune Island treasure in the wild, now confirmed. Listen okay. carefully. 
Legend says the lady on the lake will shower with treasure a three star R8. <laughs> okay, well, we're Plus, not doing that the yet. The schedule is posted for the Island Conqueror round five. We managed to find a few drivers out there you haven't conquered just yet. I just don't want to be racking points on it. Let's try this fourth gear, maybe. All right, it doesn't want to slide too well, and that's okay. That's why we're going to the Drift Club 2.0, man. We get to drift cars that actually are built for drifting. I'm curious, are we going to have another cutscene like we did in the uh, the first campaign, right? I mean, that was really cool to see that. So hopefully, they've done it again for us. And here we go. Ooh, how you doing? Nice house, man. Look at this place. Let's see if he wants to do co-op, man. Here we go. I got you, Floppy. Come on now. Come on in. I'll have a quick sip of my coffee. Cheers. Anybody that is watching down below, let me know what you're sipping on down below. Why am I on Fortune Island? Well, lately I've been taking a keen interest in history and geology, you see, and, uh, <laughs> nah, I'm only kidding. It's Drift Club, of course. Some rather high profile and talented members have been kind enough to lend me their cars. This is the HSV Malu Gen F. It belongs to my friend Josh, who races in something called Formula Drift. You don't need to know what that is. All you need to know is that it has a supercharged 6.2 litre V8 that makes a thousand brake horsepower. Off we go then. How come they're acting like we don't know Formula Drift? Where's this? Of course we know Formula Drift, man. What do you think this is? A little bit of jazzy music playing in the back. Nice easy corners to start. Remember, speed, turn in, feather the e-brake and just Sorry, yeah, I'm sure you remember. All right, here we go. What do we need here? We need points. 148. We need 30,000 on this damn drift zone. Shouldn't be a problem. This thing is pretty much ready to drive anyway, so... I do like that they give us... My friend Josh is actually Australian. The he actual drift zone to complete here. The right -hand drive. It might also explain any sudden urge to abandon the route and just do, um, what I believe are called doughies. I don't know what you just said, sir, but... Taught this one everything they know I did. We're killing this. I was going to make a point about counter steering, but it hardly oh, we got, necessary We now. got Floppy still behind. Oh, there he is right there. What's up, my man? It's co-op. Fortune Island. Let's get it. Oh, shit. The weight of the wheel. It's strong, man, but this is fun. And just rip. No, no, no. Thank you. Oh yeah, that angle kit. Look at that angle kit pulling me forward, man. Are we done? Yeah, we're done. We're done. Woo! Get it, my man. Get it. Good run. Nicely done. We'll have a drift club thriving on Fortune Island in no time. You're damn right, sir. If Let's we go. we can only figure out where to photocopy the flyers. And I said, that gotta be three stars, man. Gots to be three. The body kit on this car, though, is definitely aggressive on that front splitter, man. Look at that. Now, speaking of uh, a yellow car, oh my god. Tell me you guys seen... TJ Hunt's newest video, probably not newest video anymore, but they did the reveal of Kelvin's 240, and oh my god, man, I cannot believe um, what what they did to it, man. I can't believe it. If you guys didn't see it, you definitely need to check it out. Hopefully you're not afraid of a big old penis on the side of a car, man. That's all I'm saying, right? We're thinking about making Fortune Island the permanent headquarters at Drift Club. What do you think? I'll send some letters. Trust me. Anyway, let's get on with the drifting, shall we? This okay. is my friend Matt's 97 Nissan 240SX. It has a 7-litre supercharged V8 putting out 1,250 brake horsepower. He actually doesn't race this one anymore, but heaven knows why. Now we're just standing in the, uh, the middle of a storm casually, having a chat, right? I mean, they could have threw a damn tarp over us or something. Here we go. Remember, shift the weight forward and you lose grip in the rear. Don't now tell me that, sir. Get going. Please like and subscribe. Big thank you, Floppy. We got another drift zone. Is this the same damn spot pretty much? Or are these just sections of the big toge mountain? No, no, I think these are new. They tell me that the 240SX body is pretty standard among Formula Drift drivers. Though, of course, Matt has put more gizmos and gadgets in his than a Swiss Army knife. Oh, shit, I had to fix that up. There you are. Come on, let's see some more then. I'm trying, sir. We got a tight corner. The new first rule of Drift Club is do whatever this one does. Oh, you're right, sir. I'm not over here. We're just going to leave it in some fourth. Oh, shit. Screwed that up big time on that initiation. I right, hear it. I right, hear it. We got enough points, I feel like, now for 
for top. Yeah, we needed 75,000. Look at this. We're 240. We're good. I can just hold this nice and steady. We can just loot this whole thing. There we go. 360 it. Double 360 into the house. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Yes, we're one step closer to claiming this island. Okay. The club executive committee are meeting tonight if you'd like to come. Oh, we'll shit. Biscuits. biscuits, man. I love biscuits. A little bit of damn team biscuits. Let me know. Coffee or tea? What do you drink? I hope you guys are all getting your Christmas shopping done too, right? I mean, I just finished up the last few that I needed. Thankfully for Amazon Prime this year, I uh, definitely helped out, man. I don't know. I don't know what I would have done, man. I went to the mall. I didn't really see anything that I wanted. I mean, I don't know. It's, online's the way to go now, man. I was, I was even seeing things online that were cheaper in store. It was absolutely crazy. We got $190,000 on that. Big thank you. This is it. I've spoken to the festival and to the authorities. If you can pull this off, we can make the island our permanent headquarters. They, they might even let us rename it. Are you ready? I've got just a machine for you to do it in. My friend Andy's BMW 325i. Standard Chevy LS-based engine, 6.2 litre V8. But it does have one massive advantage. You're behind the wheel. Yeah, there you go. I'll let this man leave for a bit. There we go, there we go. That's a formula drift machine, so you've got over 70 degrees of steer angle to play with. By which, I mean, try not to pitch it over a cliff. I feel like they're talking to us like we're just, we're stupid, man. I mean, they're, like we're a bunch of nine-year-olds out here, right? I mean, I don't know. We all know formula drift and steering angles and how they work, especially if you're playing Fortune Island out here. There we go, there we go. Well, co-op tandems. Drop it in nice and low. Try to reel them back in. Second gear's got a really good power band to it. I like Opposite it. Lock and push hard now. That's a ticket. Ooh. Go for the overtake on this one. It's got a really interesting balance to this car. I've always said that when I actually have driven this thing. I don't need those pylons, all right, that's fine. Flobby back under the lead. You like those moves, Horizon? Join the club. The drift club, that is. I mean, maybe I'll think about it. You got a signing bonus? Like what? A couple wheel spins? Oh, cooked her. That's okay. Come to our final little bit. 500 yards. Just gonna finish this off. Hopefully clean. Oh my god. I told you, nope. <laughs> I tried it, man. I tried to grab it. Imagine if that was for it and I just damn lost it and lost it all. That would suck. 434,000 coming down that portion of the hill. Does that mean we would have got that for the full thing? That was quite a bit. How are we ever going to top this place? Oh, it's a team score. Team score. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we're going to do one more here. Drift Club 2.0. I'm curious, how many is there to actually do? Let's go to select chapter. Uh, my convoy, yep. And we have probably 10, right? Oh, no, there's not even 10. We have only 4 left? What do we get after this, I wonder? Uh, let's try to plow through these. Our Fortune Island headquarters plan is on hold for the moment. I wanted to get us back to what Drift Club does best. Arguing over the tiniest details of drift engineering. You see, this is another custom 240SX from the Formula Drift Circuit. 95 this time with only 830 horses. So you'll have to prove this is as much about finesse as it is flat out power. I've laid in as technical a route as I could find. The rest is up to you. All right, here we go. Floppy's on the, uh, the sticks up there, so it's a little bit harder for him to keep up with me. So I figured, just lead it out, friend. Oh shit, oh shit, yeah. Those are just the same spot over and over again, or how's this working right now? There's different cars. There we go.
Now you can definitely see the difference though from someone on a controller Feel to a wheel. This is exactly what I mean. We're Believe taking a not, right. Formula drift is all about Oops. how much traction you can maintain. Yeah, everyone loves the dirt driving. A little bit of damn Jim Cotta out here I on the dirt. I think those tires can stand up to a little more, don't you? I think so. Pretty good, though. 158, Team Tandem. Going up to the hills, man. I can't wait for damn snow on here. It's going to be crazy on Fortune Island. Maybe get a blizzard of some sort, right? I mean, it's going to be nuts. I'm excited. One point eight left to go. Slow it down for him for a second. Ooh. This is a fun damn spot to run here. There we go, there we go. Inches from the fence. Oh wow, that was a good run. 241. Where you at floppy? Oh he's back there, he's back there. Look at the view, man. Just take it in. I love this game right now. Love the tension and detail. Oh, hello. 1.1 miles. That settles it. Oh! Special edition of the club newsletter. Oh, where's he going? Oh, shit, no. Oh, my God. I'm still going, man. I'm still going. I love that they put that in there. They let us go. Please like and subscribe, man. Listen to the man. I appreciate it. That was great. Oh, you're gonna do it again! Oh! Take care! Oh, yep. No. No! Oh! Yep. Yep, that's not good. I like how they actually let us keep going, though. Like, I don't think that was a thing before. Dangerous shit out here, man. This need for speed carbon. Oh, no. Oh! <gasps> Shit, we only have 10 seconds. Go, go, go. You should have been going. No, 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 no. Are we going to make it? Tell me this is going to be a fail. Uh, at least I'm going out with a bang. Oh, well. Good I'm pissed. Oh, there we, go. we got 600 meters and a full minute left. We're good. We were just screwing around too much last time, man. That was the problem out here. Going so quick, man. There we go. We're good. We're good. Well, here's the proof. Power isn't the most important thing in your drift setup. I mean, we had 900, sir. What do you mean? Argue the point later on. You know, just for fun. All right, another three stars. Boom. Level 129. Let's go. And we get a super wheel spin soon. Oh, Ford Falcons in the damn loop. Let's go. Give it to me, please. Oh, 8C Competiciones. Forza Edition. I'll take it. I mean, I probably will never drive it. I'll probably sell that, but... I was like, oh, you're opening Christmas gifts early? Well, just let me give you a gift. Yeah, thank you so Okay, much. so we have three left to do. I think I'm going to come back for another episode, because if you look here, 500, 450, and 1 million points for the final run here on the Drift Club 2.0, man. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy today's episode, and hopefully, you guys did enjoy this S2K for a little bit, right? It was a lot of fun. Formula Drift Cars were fun as well, too. We got some co-op tandems. Big thank you to Floppy for coming around. Huge thank you for you guys for coming around as well, too. Don't forget to slap that like button if you guys are still around. And don't forget to subscribe with post notifications, man. You guys follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All of which are found down below. I'm out. Peace.